What's up, everyone? We've got a good one today. We've got another pack battle within uh, between 2020 Mosaic NFL and 2020 Prism NFL. Um, between the two, go ahead and comment below what you think or who you think, which of these two are you think is going to yield a better hit. Um, I personally think Mosaic is going to... Um, there's going to be a better hit in Mosaic, not because um, it's a better product, but because the chances of pulling something um, exciting is a lot higher than Prism. From what I've seen anyway, I've, I've watched, I've been a part of a few Prism breaks. I've watched people open up boxes on YouTube. Um, and from what I can tell in this, what's really discouraging is the price of it on the resale market. I got these all on the resale market. The price of this on the resale market, but also when you open them up, the rookies, if you don't get one of the big three or uh, a Justin Jefferson or a Chase Claypool uh, or a Jordan Love or uh, one of the more sought after rookies, all the other rookies are in their combine unis. And so when you see silver coming and uh, you're excited and you see the rookie shield and then it's it's a it's Raekwon Davis running his 40 in in the uh, the combine. And so, again, I think this is the better product, but I think this is going to give us a better hit. And so let's let's go for it. Um, never opened up Prism before. I mean, I'll, I'll put, I've opened the cello um, and I got nothing. I, I experienced what a lot of people were experiencing with, uh, <laughs> with the rookies being in combine unis. And then also that there were names that I've, Never heard in my life. Um, it's for the first time hearing them. And in other words, there were no names. And so I wasn't too happy about that. So I can see we're starting off with the Russell Wilson. Um, let me put this one on the side. So we've got a Russell Wilson base, Julian Edelman. I've got a friend who's a big Seahawks fan. I've got a friend who's a big Patriots fan. And so if nothing else in this pack uh, pops up, at least I get to bless a few friends with it. Kevin Byard, Tiki Barber, Joey Bosa, JJ Watt, Kyle Fuller, Len Dawson. Oh, Leighton Van Der Esch. And I see our red is, is this a silver? Nope. We got Leighton Van Der Esch, a Christian McCaffrey, uh, who has been dodging the playoffs. He didn't want to jump on anybody's teams. Shout out to all of those who have Christian McCaffrey on their playoff teams and have been patient. We got a rookie, red. It looks like a Chief Clyde Edwards Eler. That's a nice one. I'll go ahead and put that on the side. We've got a red skin, not a rookie, Dwayne Haskins, second year. We've got a rookie green, Jordan Love. Jordan Love, I will take that. That's a nice one. Not one of the big three uh, quarterback rookies, but uh, this guy's got potential if he's playing behind Aaron Rodgers. We'll see some ROI later on in the year. Oh, just flipped over. I saw Carson Wentz. Poor guy, man. I just, I just don't know, man. It's, it's a good quarterback. We've got a will to win, Jerry Rice. Dak Prescott would have win Prism. And I, uh, Jonathan Taylor, Jacob Eason, another quarterback rookie, which I will take. An NFL debut. Looks blue. I'm going to go ahead and guess CeeDee Lamb. Another Jacob Eason. Okay. I will take that. Jacob Eason, please start. <laughs> please start and make a lot of your card owners happy. Zach Moss and the last card. A lot of rookies in this one. A Hall of Fame. Michael... Irvin. So, I this wasn't such a bad hanger. Not a bad hanger at all. Um, let's go ahead and sleeve these up real quick. I don't know how I feel, or at least what to expect from Jacob Eason. Uh, I don't know if he's good enough to be an NFL starting quarterback and from uh, trade rumors suggest that Carson Wentz would be a good, would be suitable 
would be a good suitor for the Indianapolis Colts, which I I don't disagree with. But all us card card owners, <laughs> pretty certain that we all want Jacob Eason. I'm that stuff off. Jacob Eason to take the starting job and win a bunch of Super Bowls and be the NFL MVP numerous times. Okay, let's get into the Panini. Um, oh. Okay. Let's see. I'm, oh man, I'm excited. Okay, here we go. Now, from what I hear, if there is a kid reporter in the back, that means you've got a rookie variation, one of those negatives. Um, and so hopefully that's one of the big three, because if it is, we've made a lot of money. So the thing about prisms is it's harder to come by hit. But when you do, boy, do you hit. Because it's so expensive and because it's so hard to get, um, hits are worth, obviously, much more. So that there. Okay, we've got a Sam Darnold, Philip Rivers, Marlon Humphrey, Josh Allen, Brian Dawkins. I should go from the top, huh? Yep, okay. Tyrell Williams. See, I've never opened a pack. I don't know what to expect and when to expect it. And so um, the rookie could come out of nowhere, right? Michael Gallup, that's nice. These are nice cards. I, I like these cards. Malcolm Butler, uh, Shaquille Barrett, okay, let's see, am I almost there, am I at that rookie variation yet, not a rookie, Raheem Mostert, please, please, please start on uh, this, in this week, in week 15, I have my fantasy semifinals resting on whether or not this guy plays, Trey Boston, it's a rookie. It's blue. I think this might be the variation. It's a... No, it's a purple. J.K. Dobbins? J.K. Dobbins. A J.K. Dobbins rookie variation. I like that. Um, I'm a Cincinnati Bengal fan. And so... I mean... Oh, and we've got silver. Let's see. Rook... I saw a Tampa Bay Buccaneer. Uh, if it's a rookie, that'd be kind of disappointing. But if it's Tom Brady... No! <laughs> Jason Pierre-Paul Silver. Okay. I went ahead and threw my one hit so far on, on my mat in excitement. And here, I think this is the Red Cracked Ice. Is that what it's called? <laughs> Who knows? Okay, let's see. Uh, it's a bangle, but it's not going to be the bangle. But it's going to be my bangle. CJ Uzama. I will take that for the PC. The next card is going to be Kenny Galladay, um, Kyle Juszczyk, uh, where am I put this, right here, okay. And then the rookie, it's a blue, it's a bill, Gabriel Davis, and so not, not a really good rookie to pull unless something happens in the next few years but we'll end it with a emergent Jalen Hurts okay and the last card is gonna be a rookie blue and his combine uni Trayvon Diggs and so okay let's go ahead and recap the hits and then um what is this is that all from the cards I think so maybe I shouldn't do it on a black mat huh let's leave up these bad boys Jalen Hurts I think this is a pretty decent hit. Played really well this past week. Um, not sure if they won. I think they did win. I think they beat, was it the Saints? See, I've got no stock in those games because none of my players play for either the Eagles or the Saints. This is a personal hit. Here's a Jason Pierre-Paul Silver. Not numbered or anything. And then the J.K. Dobbins. Rookie, very, is that a, that's a hair? Gross. Okay. J.K. Dobbins, rookie variation. I, I think this is a nice card. It looks nice. Okay. And so, we'll go ahead and just lay this out here on the top. You guys can get a better look at it. I'll move these 
these base cards on the side. And I'll lay these out on the bottom. Let me see, get it in frame. And that's the hits. Uh, go ahead and tell me who you think, um, which product you think did better. I think personally, because of the variation, um, just by a hair, I think Prism won. But I mean, this Jordan Love Green and this Clyde, um, what is that, Orange Reactive contenders. And so go ahead and comment below who you think won. Uh, I'll be doing a few more of these pack battles. Again, I'll do one with Mosaic and I'll do one with, again, uh, um, what's that called? A Mosaic and another Prism. Uh, and I've got a few more that I want to do, but I got to get my hands on some product. I want to do a blaster, excuse me, a hanger of um, Mosaic basketball. And if I can get my hands on a hanger of NBA hoops, I would like to go ahead and do another pack battle. Um, but yeah, that's uh, the rip for today. Until the next rip, see you guys later.